Joining me now uh, live is the Gainsborough MP, Sir Edward Lee. RF Scampton is in his constituency. Uh, Sir Edward, good evening to you. Good evening. Uh, do you think there is a plan to house migrants at Scampton? Have you been able to find out for sure a definite answer on this? We haven't been given the official notification, but I know that civil servants are working on it. So we have to assume this story is true. Do you know if the council have been told anything? Uh, they have not been told anything officially, so the policy has not been decided. But I've just lobbied the Home Secretary personally in the lobby as we're voting. And I asked her that question this morning, and they are looking at it. And I obviously I object very strongly. We've worked flat out for two years to get £300 million worth investment. But the Home Secretary has said to me that if the migrants come there, it will be, in her words, strictly temporary and she will work with the council and the company to ensure it does not stop the deal. In it, other words, the new heritage centre. Isn't it embarrassing um, that the government, knowing you've been working on the future of the site, we even mentioned it last night, that, that you didn't know about this? I mean, you must be annoyed. I, I am I'm, I'm extremely annoyed that I only found out about this um, a couple of weeks ago because of a tip-off, frankly, a leak. I'm very annoyed I've had no official notification, but I'm not going to stand on my personal pride. All I care about is ensuring for the first time ever that we get a really good deal for an XRF base. It doesn't just go to rack and ruin. And what we're talking about here, the home, the damn buses, the red arrows, is really exciting. And anything the government does to put migrants there temporarily must stop, stop the wonderful deal but, for North Lincolnshire. But the thing, yeah, I accept your deal, but the thing is that the, the, the migrants have to go somewhere uh, and maybe, maybe better than being in, in, in hotels. Well, of course, that's what will be said. And everywhere that the Home Secretary tries to put migrants, local MPs object. But I said I represent 600 square miles. You know, put them anywhere. But please don't stop the deal we've been working on because it's going to create so many jobs. It's such a wonderful opportunity. So uh, I'm, I'm not a NIMBY. You know, put them somewhere <laughs> else, but not. don't stop this deal. OK, OK, don't stop the deal. Final question. What is temporary in, 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 your, in your vocabulary? Are we talking weeks? Are we talking months? Are we talking years? Absolutely no more than two years. Of course, uh, Scampton Holdings, which is now the preferred bidder, will have to get the deal up and running. They've got to okay. get all the planning permission. So maybe not much will happen okay. in a few months. So it is strictly temporary. So Edward Lee, good to talk to you tonight. Thank you uh, Thank very you, much Peter. indeed. Uh, be uh, good.